Seven months ago, I did a video explaining exactly why I loved Ander Herrera. I just wanted to do a short video here on why I love Ander Herrera and why he's my favourite non-Mancunian at the club. Here are a few reasons why. Ander Herrera talks the talk and walks the walk. Seven months later, my opinion has not changed. If anything, my opinion has got stronger. This season, under Jose Mourinho, Ander Herrera has developed himself into one of our best players. He's forced himself into the Spain squad. He's forced himself into becoming a regular starter for Manchester United. And for fans, after the last few years, we've seen so many transfers happen, so many players come and go from the club. But Ander Herrera is somebody who is playing for the shirt. You see how much it means to him to play for Manchester United. And that has helped him build a fantastic rapport with the fans. He celebrates wildly when he's on the pitch when he scores goals. He celebrates wildly when he's on the bench when other teammates score goals. Off the pitch, he speaks like an ambassador for the club. And it really isn't hard to see why Manchester United fans have built up such a close relationship with Ander Herrera in such a short space of time. Add in the fact that he's a player who other fans love to hate because he's got a snide side, a real innocent exterior, but Ander Herrera knows when to pull a shirt, knows when to go down, and he knows the game of football. That helps, it just brings a whole different level to his character. And Manchester United haven't had that many characters over the recent years, so that again is another reason why Ander Herrera is so special to the fans. So when reports emerged that new Barcelona boss Ernesto Valverde was interested in bringing Ander Herrera to the new camp, I'll be honest, I did start to worry. He's a Spaniard. He's going to be linked with a move back to Spain at some point. And why wouldn't he be tempted by Barcelona? Yes, they may not have won the league this year, but they're still one of the biggest clubs in the world. Would Ander Herrera be interested in a move back there? Working with a former boss, Valverde. He worked with him at Athletic Bilbao. Well, maybe not, because reports from ESPN, reports from The Times, reports from The Telegraph, all saying that Ander Herrera is prepared to snub a move to Barcelona because he sees his long-term future at Manchester United. Just in case Ander Herrera didn't have enough of my heart, another little piece of it goes to him just for that. Ander Herrera gets what it means to play for Manchester United. He plays for the badge on his chest, not just the wages in his pocket, although I'm sure they do help. When he's visiting takeaways in Manchester after the Player of the Year awards, when he's reading the Red News fanzine in the back of J-Stand during our 2-0 win over Crystal Palace the last game of the season, he's already an adopted mank. And again, that's another reason why fans have built up such a rapport with him. Loyalty in football is a rare commodity in, in the modern age with oil money coming in, all the TV deals making it very hard to keep a logic of what money means anymore. But for me, Ander Herrera strikes me as a player where loyalty is more important than the amount of zeros on the end of his pay packet. I might be proved completely wrong, and I really hope I'm not, but everything I've seen from Ander Herrera so far in a Manchester United shirt shows me that, that I'm not sure there has been a better captain material at the club for a long time since Ander Herrera. And when Wayne Rooney leaves this summer, I hope to see the armband go on Herrera because I think he absolutely deserves it. And if he does turn down a move to Barcelona just to stay at Manchester United and to complete his career, I don't know, maybe stay until he retires. Sod knows. But I love Ander Herrera. I said it seven months ago. I'll say it now. I'll say it in another seven months' time. I haven't seen many players like him in recent years at the club. And for me, I love him.